Hey, this is Aaron. And Blake. We're AV Data. Thanks for learning how to automate the boring with Alteryx. In this video, we're taking a look at the components of the Alteryx environment. There are four main components that we're going to discuss today in addition to the search bar. The first one is the uh, tool palette, which is where our tools and tool categories live. The second one is our canvas, which is where we uh, build our workflows, we connect our tools. The third one is very important. Uh, this is our configuration panel. This is where we uh, tell our tools how to behave, what we want them to do. And then uh, the fourth section, also very important, is the results window, uh, where we can see how our tools act on our data. So we've got, let's see here, the toolbar, tool palette, the canvas, third, the configuration panel, and last but not least, the results window. Very good, Aaron. Glad you remembered those. Those are tough. Um, so we're generally going to start up with our um, tools. Uh, a lot of the times the first tool that we're going to bring out is going to be an in-out tool. Um, so we're going to bring in an input data tool. We uh, drag it onto our canvas. Our canvas is infinitely large. Um, zoom or, in. Zoom out. Exactly. Zoom, zoom, zoom. You can move your tools wherever you want. You can, you can set up your canvas how you want it to be set up. And we also have a video on documentation and organization of workflows. We're going to use our configuration panel to uh, choose the file that we want to look at. Uh, we're going to look at one sheet in a uh, demo file that we have here. We'll hit the run button to have our data get pulled through. We can also always change how our tools configured. I'm going to go ahead and bring in a select tool next. Um, you'll notice that the select tool has a different looking configuration panel, and most tools do, because tools do different things, they need to be configured differently. We're going to go ahead and uh, deselect all the fields, except for the first three, just so that you can see the difference between the data going into the tool and the data coming out of the tool. Taking a closer look at the results window, we can select the input or output anchor, either directly in the results window or on the tool itself and see the data as it flows into the tool or after the tool. And lastly, the search bar in the top right corner allows us to search for tools and topics, even looking through the Alteryx documentation and the community. Thank you for learning with us today. Good luck on your Alteryx journey. For more information on custom training, managed service automations, and more, please visit our website at abdataconsulting.com.